defenders like Kawhi, PG, mm-hmm. Russ, Sue, like how much of those guys, veterans who have done in this league, helped you on that end? Um, it helped a lot. Uh, just to see the angles that they take on the defense end, um, how they always in position, even when they late sometimes, or like uh, they don't even feel like they late on rotations at all, or you know, uh, in down actions, you know, they get caught in, in uh, low man, but they get out so easily, you know, to. Uh, uh, real that uh, guy to come off the screen. They do it so easy, so it's good to have those guys, you know, to set that set that tone on the defense end. What was practice like yesterday? What did you guys get to do? Um, it was a lot. Uh, a lot of like attention to detail stuff. Um, we got like some up and down action. A lot of running, of course. When you guys have days like this, you know, uh, first day in LA, really practicing the sense of media day since we got out to you know Hawaii and Seattle. Like, what was it like finally get back home? This, this is y'all. This is yeah, I'm gonna be for the season. What was it like to get that bump in, mm-hmm. like in, uh, in the home gym? Oh, um, it was good just to be back in LA, uh, home grounds. Obviously, we was in Hawaii, then we went to Seattle, so it was a lot of traveling, uh, five, six hour flights. But it was good though. We got back here, got some good work in. Uh, we hit on what we had to hit on, and um, it's just good to be back here in the home grounds. How's the body feeling? Good. I got a uh, cold sweat yesterday, so I'm feeling a little good. Good. Yeah. I ain't been in there in a minute. <laughs> Cold as a ball. <laughs> well, I was going to ask you about your offseason. Ooh, you dropped 56 in front of AI this yeah. summer. Did that – had you met him before that interaction? Or what, um, was, what was that like? No, nah, I haven't met him before that, but uh, we used to talk on DMs and stuff like that. He used to always, you know, just give me high praise and stuff like that. But just to see him in person, it was dope for me. I used to watch AI growing up. So just to see him, you know, in the city that he played in, in Philadelphia, and, uh, you know, have a big, big night like that. It was, it was huge for me just to – you know, for him to be front row, so it was big. So you saw him there, so you kind of thought, was it? Was there any thought of your mind like, okay, I need to do something, show some little extra because he's here? <laughs> nah, just play my my natural game. You know, I just take over from there. I had that type of game where you know everybody's falling in love with it. You know, uh, the flashes, just everything, the scoring spree. So it was just good. When you guys would talk about DM, and also like this, this also makes me think about when you play with Kyrie this summer too. Mm-hmm. Like you have these interactions with these guys at your position or kind yeah. Of, you know, talk, like, are you using those to like build confidence in yourself, those interactions, or are you trying to pick up skill things from them? Um, just everything, honestly. Uh, when I'm when I went to you know play with Kyrie, it was just big just to go play in his event and um, just see his footwork and everything, just being there, you know, being on his team, and, you know, him killing them on the side and playing right with him. So it was dope just to be on the on the same uh same side as him, playing alongside him because obviously you know, we're in the league now we play against each other all the time, but. You know, to share the same, uh, share the team, share the same backcourt. It was dope, man. You know, it's him, you know, preaching stuff and just talking. You know, just how he carries himself. You know, besides the media, where everybody portrays him, he's a great human being, and uh, you know, even better basketball player. What's the best thing that he or AI told you? Oh man, I'm a killer. Just like that, I'm a killer. Just keep going, star potential. You know, and just just keep being myself and whatever I'm doing and uh, everything else. Will, you know, fall in line for me. Kawhi brings your name up a lot whenever we talk about point guards. Like, obviously, we talk about Russ, but he always mentions your name about just kind of being a stabilizing force offensively. Mm-hmm. Seems like he's really a big fan of your game. Just what's that connection been like with him? Um, Just dope, man. Honestly, uh, just to see Kawhi just always back in my play like that and, um, you know, just having confidence and trust in me as well. Um, just to share the same you know, floor as him, you know, go to go to war with him, go to battle with him. It's very dope. Uh, obviously, I always got Kawhi back, and uh I always let him know he can count on me. It's like, you know, I know I can count on him. So, you know, that's a teammate's thing. And, uh, you know, the trust just goes a long way. And um, as you see, just the connection just there with me and Kawhi. But, like, there aren't a lot of small guards, like, even in camp, even at this time of year. So it's really just you and Russ and X. How, how's X been pushing you in the spot that you're in right now? Um, Big, man. You know, X is a, he, he's been having a phenomenal just summer, preseason. Uh, training camp, everything. So, you know, I feel like we all just pushing each other. You know, we all want to get better. So we all just pushing each other in the, in the right uh, trending. So it's, it's good, man, just to have X, you know, here too as well, to keep pushing me and, uh, you know, to rush to keep pushing me as well. And, um, you know, I want to push those guys too. So it's good to have, you know, three guards who, you know, just want to get better each and every day and just push each other and just go after it. Are you guys ready for the season? Or you kind of like this long training camp? Nah, I feel like we're ready. I feel like we we on the verge of like, you know, almost you know, we obviously want to get through preseason, but I feel like we just already you know, play the first game and just get this thing rolling. But you know, everything just take time day by day, but nah, I feel like I definitely feel like we're ready though. But, but we're not skipping those steps though. That was that's exactly what Kawhi said last year. Yeah. When he came back, we 
felt like everyone was excited to see him back. And obviously, you weren't here to start, but yeah. how, how are things a little different, I guess, this time around versus what you can remember from when you joined mid-season? Um, you know, last year when I came, uh, everything was being thrown at me at once. Uh, plays, um, you know, just meeting everybody, new staff, new building, new everything. So I had to get, you know, used to everything. But now I feel like I'm I'm more, you know, comfortable. I'm more aware of everything. Um, I'm more aware of the plays, you know, how the defensive scheme is ran, you know, how the offensive scheme is ran. You know, just everything. I feel much more comfortable. I just feel like, you know, I'm just 100% all the way to myself now. You know, I can just, you know, just be me and not worry about the, you know, the other things off the floor. You know, as far as like, you know, when I first came having to move, you know, I had to worry about my family, you know, moving out here as well too. So I feel like I'm just all set now. I can just, you know, focus just on basketball. So it's been good for me. Well, what kind of peace of mind does that give you now that you don't, like, especially the moving stuff, that's that's a yeah, lot to deal it's with. A lot. Yeah, just a, you know, peace of mind. Uh, I'm not thinking about, you know, oh, how am I gonna get, you know, my bed here, you know, where I'm gonna live at. You know, I was, when I first came, I was living at the hotel. So it was just a lot going on. And on top of that, still having to come and produce and do, you know, my job each and every day. So, you know, it's been good though that I'm here now and I can just, you know, be free and just be myself with peace of mind.